everybody, welcome back to Epic Beauty Fail. On today's video, I am gonna be trying out the new Ciate London Glitter Flip Lipsticks. So I did pick up three shades. I picked up the three lightest shades. Um, they have some really interesting colors out there. They have like a blue and a purple, and honestly, I will never wear those. And I did pay for these myself, so I didn't wanna buy them and then never wear them. So, I picked up three colors. I got the color Candy, Infamous, and Forbidden. <clears throat> there are the shades right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the, the lightest color, which is Candy, and I'm gonna show you how these things work. So, there it is. It's got a really nice pretty packaging. It's got like a silver glittery lid. Um, yeah, this is just a really pretty pink color. I don't know if the camera's going to pick that up or it's just going to be really glary. Um, so I'm really excited to give these a try. I saw a couple other YouTube videos with them and I thought that they were really pretty. So I wanted to give them a try as well. So if you haven't seen these, what you need to do with these are you put them on your lips. You put one layer on your lips and then you wait until it dries and then you push, press your lips together and they turn glittery. So they start out matte and then turn glittery. Now one thing I do not particularly like about this is the way the doe foot applicator looks. I don't know if the camera will pick that up real well, but it looks really like like frayed almost. When I first opened this up, I thought I might have gotten like a bad one, but then I opened the up, other two up and they all look the same. So, all right. Now I'm going to go ahead and put this pink one on. This is the pink one called Candy, and we'll see, look and see how it goes. All right, so there it is, and I'm going to go ahead and zoom you in, actually, so you can see this. So there's the color Candy. It's a really nice pink color, and when you first put it on, it's not super glittery. glittery. Like, you can see some of the glitter over here. Um, but it's not like super coming out. So I'm going to let this dry for a minute. All right. So it's been over a minute. You can see it's nice and matte right now. So what I'm supposed to do now, I did, it does feel very dry. It feels very dry. Um, what you're supposed to do is just press your lips together and the, it should turn glittery. So here we go. Okay, so I don't know if the camera's going to pick that up super well because this is just a very light glitter, but it's definitely glittery. Um, I don't know if you can see it there. I don't feel like it took any of the lipstick off looking at it, uh, but it's got almost like a pink and purple glitter in it um, that did come out. So I don't see any on my teeth. I don't see any on my tongue, but it is very dry, so I really want to lick my lips. Um, I don't know if that'll stay real dry, but right now it feels really dry. But I really like this color. It's just a nice, soft pink color, and I'm really, really liking it. Uh, the other two are darker, so we'll get into those, uh, but I really like it. And I don't think the glitter is too, like, really out there. Like, I've had some other lipsticks that when they are glittery, they are like everywhere. So I do feel like the glitter is getting like a little bit outside my lips over here, like on the outside of the lips and a little bit over here, but it's glitter. So it's going to get everywhere. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and wipe this off and move on to the next one. I think we're starting with a pretty clean slate right there. And the next color I'm going to use is Infamous, which is a little bit darker of a pink. It's not quite such a high, can well, candy pink. So it's got the same packaging, but it is more of a reddish tint um, than the other one was. So we will go ahead and get this one on my lips.
there it is applied with a single layer and don't mind this I don't know how to line my lips um <laughs> they're a little wonky uh but don't mind that um I can see the glitter a little bit in this one as well but not it's not like not all over the place so I'm gonna go ahead and let this dry gotta give it a minute and see what it looks like all right so my time has passed it's nice and dry my lips feel nice and dry I'm gonna go ahead and push them together and see what I got <laughs> all right so I didn't know what to expect here the glitter is a little bit more of like a silver glitter almost I think looking at it I mean there's definitely pinks and purples in there but I swear I see like a silver glitter and I don't know if you guys can see it on screen but I'm definitely seeing like a silver glitter on this one I think I like this one better I don't know what do you guys think I don't know if it was applied a little bit better maybe I'd like it better but I think I do like this one better I think it depends on the situation I don't know I like that. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get this one off and move on to the third color that I do have. All right, foundation's looking a hot mess, but we will move on to the third color that I do have. This is the color Forbidden, and this is a darker red, like a deep red color. And there it is. And um, I actually used to wear a color like this when I was like, a teenager I used to wear really dark red lipstick and I loved it so this is the color that I initially picked out the very first one I picked out because I thought it was really really neat I mean look at that I really like that color can't really wear it every day now but I really like this color so go, we'll go ahead and get this on okay Yeah, this is definitely a color I wore back in the day. I like this color a lot. Now, you can definitely still see the glitter. This one I feel like is more metallic. And I think they're supposed to be actually metallic. Uh, but I definitely feel like this is more metallic than the other two are. I'm going to go ahead and let this dry and I'll see you in a minute. All right, this is the last one. Let's see what it looks like. Um, like, so this looks more metallic and I can definitely see some of the glitter in this one, but let's see what it looks like. Okay. I, can you tell I really like this color? Um, I don't know, it's not on my teeth definitely still feels dry um did not transfer to my tongue i really kind of like that i really do um it's definitely not a color i'd wear every day like i said when i was like 18 19 i wore a lip color just like this and i wore it every day now that i'm a little older like 20 years older not something I could get away with every day. I mean, I guess I probably could if I wanted to. Gosh darn it. I can wear whatever I want. Um, but I really like this color. What do you guys think? I think for the look that I have on, probably the candy color would be the best one to go with this. But my biggest complaint about these is that they do feel very, very drying. Um... I don't feel like it's transferring at all. I don't feel like it's getting on my tongue when I do lick my lips, but they are very drying, very much so. Um, but overall, I like them. I think they're a neat concept, very, very neat concept. So 
Anyhow, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up down below. If you haven't already and you'd like to be, please hit that red subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell so you get alerted when I do post new videos. And if you have any comments, have you tried these out? Do you want to give them a try? Let me know down in the comment section down below. Um, I just really like this color. Anyhow, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time on Epic Beauty Veil. Vale. Bye!